What's going on, y'all? It's your boy Alex. Make sure you like, make sure you subscribe. And today we're here to talk about how Dave Chappelle, the baby, now even Halloween Kills, has been called out and called to be canceled by the LGBTQ plus community, the alphabet community. Like y'all like to joke and call them. All right, y'all don't cancel me. I'm just joking. But I'm here to tell y'all it's not really the LGBTQ community that's canceling all these people, okay? It's really the Matrix AKA the government, AKA whatever you want to call them, New World Order, it doesn't matter. The system is hiding behind the LGBTQ to cancel all these people. That's what I need you guys to understand. Listen, I have a lot of gay lesbian friends. I ain't with anybody, you know what I'm saying? I'm cool with everybody. I have not run into one gay, lesbian, queer friend, nothing who has a, any type of a problem with what Dave Chappelle said. They damn sure ain't got a problem with Halloween Kills. And for those of y'all who don't know why I'm bringing up Halloween Kills, apparently the LGBTQ community has a problem with Mike Myers, a psychopathic serial killer in a fictional horror movie who keeps chasing after his sister and can't be killed. You know, he done been stabbed in the neck, his head done been chopped off, he done been shot, he's still alive. So I showed you how realistic this is supposed to be taken. But apparently they got mad because he killed a gay couple in the movie. I mean, he kills everybody. He done kill people when they was having sex. He done kill kids. He done kill men. He done kill women. But no, no, you can't kill no gay person. If you guys honestly believe that the LGBTQ community is that sick in the head, that okay dave chappelle telling a joke you might find offensive is one thing the baby talking about sucking d in a parking lot and you might find that offensive is even one thing but if you guys honestly believe in your heart of hearts that the lgbtq community literally has a problem with a fictional horror film and a death in a fictional horror film by a psychopathic serial killer you guys have a problem that's clearly an agenda Okay, if you guys are really looking through everything that's going on right now, modern feminism, because they're not fighting for rights. They're not fighting for the right to vote or the right to work or the right for abortion or none of that. They're fighting for the right to have free sex and to make more money. Right? Why? Because they're trying to get rid of the need for men. They don't want women dealing with men right now. That's why on the other side, you see MGTOW Red Pill. All MGTOW Red Pill is, is the opposite of modern feminism. <laughs> it's not men's rights. They just want y'all to hate women and not deal with women no more. And that's no different than the LGBTQ+. They want the LGBTQ+, to hate straight people. Then they want the black people to hate the white people. Then they want the Hispanic people to hate the white people. Then they want the white people to hate the, hate the Hispanic people. This is what I'm trying to tell you guys. Nobody really just comes out hating anybody. Not literally. Of course, you do have some racists. You do have some bigots. But generally, most people don't really give a damn. They're just trying to survive. They're just trying to go to work and feed their family and take care of themselves. Okay? The agenda is causing all this division. That's what I'm trying to tell you. You got people pissed off going off on the gay community. The gay community hasn't even said anything. The gay, again, I have not met one gay man, lesbian woman, queer, transgender, anything who has a problem with any of this stuff. All right, this is the media telling you guys that this is a problem. They're not saying, you're not seeing protest out there. I guarantee y'all in real life, y'all not, y'all don't know nobody or see nobody in the LGBTQ plus community who cares about this anyway. I mean, Halloween kills, give me a break. Y'all gotta stop being so simple-minded, man. Okay, like I said, modern feminism, red pill, MGTOW, LGBTQ plus and cancel culture, black versus white, white versus Hispanic, you know, Hispanic versus Asian, Asian hate, they passed the Asian hate bill. This is all part of the strategy to divide and conquer, okay? Like I said, generally, nobody hates anyone. Everybody just wanna go to work, take care of their family, and just survive man we in the middle of a damn pandemic people ain't worried about hating no goddamn body this is just fear mongering and this is social control this is a social project they're trying to separate the men from the women and trying to separate the gays from the men and the women in the straight community as well this is all separation tactics because a nation divided is easy to conquer <laughs> but you know at this point we're clearly going into something else guys like i said it's the internet of things we got digital money now crypto you using v bucks you're not spending real cash no more debit card number replace cash you're talking about some national cash shortage our money ain't been backed by gold in years so this is all part of the greater agenda all right now i don't want to go too deep into what that agenda is i could but my real point in making this video is don't be mad at the lgbtq plus community because they're not the ones behind any of this the industry, like I said, the matrix, the new world order, whatever you want to call it, the feds, whatever you want to call them, they're the ones doing this. It's not the LGBTQ plus community, guys. All right? So don't let them fill y'all hearts or whatever the case may be with the vision. 
right? They don't have a problem with this stuff. It's all the media playing tricks on you guys' mind, right? So don't go out there with that energy thinking, oh, here come this faggy and he this and he that. He not worried about you. And he ain't worried about Chappelle and he ain't worried about Halloween kills and he ain't worried about the baby. All right, this is all cap, this is all gas, this is all an agenda, this is all the matrix. So I just wanted to come and tell y'all that really quick. I'm Alex and I'm out. Peace.